Hello, welcome to the Bachelor of Computing Academic Information Session at the Spring Academic Open House. My name is Greg Klotz. I am a program counselor for the Bachelor of Computing degree, and I provide academic advising to students. Basically, I help students understand their academic options from first semester course selection in the summer all the way through to graduation. My background is I have a BSc in Applied Computer Science from Ryerson, followed by an MSc and PhD in Computer Science at Guelph. Computing degrees at Guelph come in three flavors, the Bachelor of Computing General Degree, and the Bachelor of Computing Honors Degree, which has Computer Science major and a Software Engineering major, and both of those have co-op as an option. First, a brief slide about why we have our own degree, why do we have a Bachelor of Computing degree. We have a Bachelor of Engineering degree at the University of Guelph. It has a common first year where students have to take chemistry, engineering courses, engineering design, physics, etc. We have a BSc. This also has a common first year. Students are required to take chemistry, biology, physics, and calculus. And we have our own degree, the Bachelor of Computing, as this is focused on computing and it has a flexible first year where students get to choose their own electives based on their interest. So if they want, they can take chemistry or physics or more math courses, but if they prefer, they can take music, history, English, zoology, or any of our other minors. Computer science and software engineering, just to be clear, are both computing degree majors. Neither one of them is an accredited engineering degree. The Bachelor of Computing General Degree is three years of full-time study, so that assumes five courses are taken each fall and winter semester. It gives students a basic foundation in computer science. It's quick, so there is no major, no minor, no co-op, and students only have time for a few electives in computer science plus four arts and four science courses, but they do complete the core courses in computer science. The Bachelor of Computing Honors degree is four years of full time, so again assuming five courses are taken on all eight academic semesters, it's five years with the co-op option, and it gives students a foundation in computing along with specializations, and students can choose to major either in computer science or software engineering. They have computer science electives they can take in upper years, and they can minor in a different subject. The computer science major is a traditional computing degree focused on software development, has a bit more theory, theory of computation, it's flexible, mostly electives in third and fourth year, and calculus is a required course at university, so it has a little bit more math than the software engineering major. The software engineering major still has a foundation in computer science, so students still take the same core courses as the computer science majors, but has a stronger emphasis on software design as a team. Standards, processes, documentation, agile, waterfall, and other methods, professional standards. It has slightly less math. No calculus course is required to be taken at university, but it does have more teamwork-based software design courses, so it has less electives in third and fourth year. Some electives that all computing students can take are data science, cloud computing, computer networks, introduction to cryptography, image processing and vision, game programming, and in fourth year, students can also do a computer science project one-on-one -on -one with a professor if they choose to. Help on campus, there's lots of help available on campus. So for any academic type help, course selection, academic advising, I'm happy to help. If students are not sure where to get the help they need, I'm also happy to tell them what options are available, but just in brief, we have student accessibility services for students who need a little bit of extra support with their learning. We have counseling services and student health services for medical and psychological needs. And we have the library, which has lots of books, but they also offer many study and exam help and exam preparation sessions. If you have questions, I'm happy to help. You can email us at cscounts at uoguelph.ca and thank you very much for attending our virtual Spring Academic Open House.